Hi, Steven. Scott from Hey Guys. Lovely hey to guys. meet you. How are you? Great. I like, uh, like the name of your show. You can go on our roster of people who say Hey You Guys. Hey, really of course. Like. Well, yeah, I'm sure you hear that from everybody when they see. Yeah. That's what you want. Listen, That's why you called yourself Hey You Guys. That's called a good title. Yeah. Free advertising. Very it's good. all good. <laughs> What's it like working for Wes Anderson? Because he's so distinctive and he's, he has such a great vision for each of yeah. his films and they're all so individual in so many ways. What's yeah. it like performing and working with him, seeing him bring his well, stuff to I'm, life? I'm worried about my next job because I can't. there's nothing more amazing than working for Wes Anderson. So everything else is kind of... Unless there's some other amazing director. I mean, I've worked with amazing directors, but not only in front of the camera, but the atmosphere on the set. And, and um, like the dinners every night after rap, like everybody is like, we're living in the same place together and it's like family. It's more like a circus than a film set. Yeah, it's like a just circus. Just in terms of the familial kind of, so it's he a company. Yeah, he creates a sense of family. So it's just a joy to work. Oh, who's here? <laughs> hey, nice suit. Anyway. <laughs> And also, I mean, you say he has this amazing company of actors that want to work with him every yeah. single time. We'd we'll probably turn up for him for free. Yeah. That must be great to just be part of that little family of people as well. Absolutely. We're all there with the same desire to, to realize the vision of this, uh, this master, this genius, you know. So uh, it's, it's, it's fun to be there because we all are of the same mind and of the same spirit. And Wes is also... the one of the kindest people I've ever met. I mean, he's such, and, and if every once in a while, he's like, can I have it quiet? Like, I, I'm sorry if I raised my voice a little bit. I mean, he'll apologize if he raised his voice a little bit. So he's that kind of person that he's so kind. So you want to give him everything you have. Yeah. This is a final question. This is just me as a, as a fanboy. I used to love watching In Living Color. And I'm obviously a huge fan of Jim Carrey. Jamie Foxx is obviously in that show. So what, what are your, well, so are you. What are your memories of that show? Because even now, it still has such a fan base, and it's been so influential in so many ways. It's funny. A lot of people don't realize how old it is, how long ago we did it. You know, because it, there is something very contemporary about it. And I think because um, it was bespeaking something that was very true about all of us, and something that had not been represented before. And uh, yeah, we got to meet. You know, yeah. so I met her. And uh, so that was fantastic. It only took us seven years yeah. to figure out we had met and actually should be together. Yeah. No, because after I was only there for one season and then I didn't see her again for maybe almost seven years. And then we were cast in a play together, playing a couple getting a divorce. It was called Big Hunk of Burn and Love. <laughs> yeah. And uh, by the playwright Prince Gamovalos. Uh, just want to say his name. Anyway, um, <laughs> you can. yeah, and then like two years later, we were married and expecting our first child. So yeah. it's like, blah, blah, blah. Hey, job that to have. No, it was a great job for it's that a reason. Wonderful job yeah. to have. We're all we're all very. I mean, we still keep in touch with one another. It's a wonderful group of people, really, honestly. Yeah. Oh, no, good. Thank you so much for your time. How was, it in, the, how was it in Living Color in the UK? Was it pretty... I started to see on VHS for many years. Uh -huh. <laughs> of course. It's just the nature of it. As a kid, it, it wasn't was around on TV in the same. I don't think you could watch television. But I was a bit obsessed with Jim Carrey, so that it, it came from that, so... Yeah. We all were. That's why we were on the show. Thanks so much for your time. Is he here? He might be. He's a master of disguise. You never know. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you guys!